Hey, what's up YouTube? This is Skynet with another video tutorial. Today I'm gonna show you how to fix uh, the error that everyone's getting on Xbox. Uh, the error is called Humane Negative. Humane Negative is uh, uh, it's an error that it, it doesn't. There's multiple, there's multiple uh, tricks that you can work uh to try to fix it but some of them work for you know every every person or some of them work for some of them some of you and some of them they don't work so uh first thing is make sure you re reboot or restart your uh your cable modem your router your mesh system whatever you're running on your network uh make sure you restart it unplug it for like a good 60 seconds and then plug in uh every one of them one by one like if you unplug your modem unplug it and uh then let it let it come up online fully then plug your uh router as well so i'm gonna show you see this is a cable modem right here So that's the Ethernet port, the Ethernet port, and the coaxial, and the coaxial uh, connection, and the powered, the powered plug. So you unplug it for sixty seconds, then plug it, plug in the modem first. Do it sequentially, like unplug it, unplug everything at the same time, and then plug just the modem itself, and then let it come up online. Everything then plug in your your uh your internet router or a, a tip link mesh system or uh whatever you're running on your network so if that doesn't work then the next step is to here that's my xbox make sure uh push the power button until it powered off then unplug the the power cord and wait for that a good 60 second plug it back in and see if that work if it doesn't work then we're gonna go to uh setting we're gonna go to network and on network see we're gonna go to advanced advanced earning then uh as you see that's my uh information right there on ip and i'm i can change that i don't i don't really care because i'm connected behind a firewall so that's that's the dns setting you can you want to go to you want to uh clear the mac address as well i'm not gonna do it because i already did so clear the mac address and then change your dns setting i have it on automatic but you you can do manual so for example if you pick manual you can get uh quad 9 cloudflare or uh google dns or uh open open dns as well there's a lot of public dns that you can you can pick and choose just google it up uh, free public dns and you will find most of them like cloudflare uh quad 9 open dns and very sign dns uh there's multiple so you just type them over here and i'm not gonna do it because I, mine's already working so it's let's say if you type one that one that one for the cloudflare but i have it on automatic and uh so if that doesn't work, then we gotta uh, we gotta uh, make sure every time you you do a, a you change something on your Xbox, just reboot it. You have to reboot it. Period. There's no like wait until you do everything. Or you can do you can do everything then reboot everything. But you at least you have to reboot it two two times. So we have three Xbox uh, for my son and my daughter, and so see how the port thirty seventy. Uh, 3074 so 
we are game sharing. That's one of the one. That's one of the problems as well. If you're game sharing in your household or your friend, that's one. That's the problem. Like it's it's been uh been glitching. Like I was get I was getting that error and I couldn't. Uh, I figured I was working for like two days trying to figure it out, and I finally did. So I had to remove that game sharing. We had to let's stop game sharing uh with my son and. <clears throat> So we I removed game sharing then I was getting like I was loading into Warzone or like Call of Duty, you know, and it wasn't it wasn't working. I was getting a humane uh human negative error. So then I tried the port on his Xbox, I left mine port automatic. But on, you can if you're having that problem in and if you have multiple Xbox, two, three, four Xboxes in your family, make sure you select manual. So from here, just ch you select manual port. You don't have to do anything else on your on your router. So just just do it here manually. Select the port manual on every single Xbox. And I'm not gonna do it. I'm just gonna uh, just gonna leave it automatic. And you know, because on my son Xbox, I did pick a manual port, and it's been working fine. So now, <clears throat> once you do that, make sure you reboot your Xbox, and make sure you you have everything connected, Wi-Fi or uh, whatever it, whatever connection is is best for you. For me, I have my my Xbox connected a uh, hardwire, so that's my Ethernet switch connected to my PSN firewall. So then. <clears throat> That and that's how that's how you fix it, and and now I'm I'm good to go back. Uh, in the game, as you see, when I was when I was getting to this screen, it was uh, it was giving me the humane negative uh, error, because there was something, on the network was blocking it, or, uh, but I you know mostly it's something on the network blocking it because. Sometimes you may you may have a faulty uh, Ethernet switch or a faulty uh, router or faulty modem that is is it's just giving you the error. Then it's loading. See, I was getting network fail right here when I was at this, and my son's Xbox is working fine as well. And the only the only sucks part is that we had to stop sharing game, because before I was able to play multiplayer because we were sharing game. Now, see, they want me to pay for it. I ain't gonna pay not a cent for this big corporation that they don't fix their game. So that's the that's that's one of the uh, issues i was facing like two days ago so if you if you guys facing that problem just uh follow those uh procedures that i told you and believe me it will work for you uh, it worked for me i was looking for a solution everybody was saying that like, oh uh just change your dns yes in some and some of us it works by changing the dns and some of us it doesn't and some of us we have different stuff running on our network or we have multiple uh, Xbox. This work also for PS5 as well. So the same thing you go, you do uh, on PS5. And sometimes what you do is also what it works. What I end up doing is uh, going to... Wait, let me, let me get here. Mm, my games and apps also, and because sometimes when you have when this uh, uh, when Modern Warfare Three or or Warzone release an update, every little update they fix something and they mess up something. So what what you can do as well. Aside from what I already told you, you can come over here to manage and then go or oh, no manage but go to uh, games. Go to games and then you go to more options. 
and then go manage games and add on and see how you see the the save data that's a reserve uh, a reserve reserve data that that uh when we get an update everything is being collected here you know whatever fix they did they they delete the old uh the old save data that we had and then they save the uh the new the new updates here like whatever uh fix and patches they did that's you know what you do is just go here and then see how it says there and then you you want to delete everything so if you delete this uh it's gonna delete your your settings on the on the game when you log back into the game you're gonna uh you're gonna have to re uh reset everything up you know like do your uh uh what is it called your tactics your tactics sprint uh your some of your weapons uh the weapons it won't fix with your weapons as long as long as uh, you have saved the loadout but you have you want to delete that delete that and then back out and then reboot your xbox as well so it's gonna uh, i'm gonna tell you exactly what it will mess up on the game so see it will it will make you uh agree to the terms and conditions and <clears throat> it's gonna uh your uh your controller some of your controller setting my my node is gonna go reset to the default sometimes for me i had everything saved so i didn't it didn't it didn't mess anything up other than i had to uh once i logged back into the game i had i had to like uh, accept the terms and conditions and acknowledge the whatever uh whatever trash they put on there so that's all i did and like i said that's gonna fix your uh issues but uh just do what i told you i already told you and you you should be fine uh, changing your dns or or rebooting your network if it doesn't work uh then that's i mean it's gonna it's something is gonna work out for you but if it doesn't uh that means either you sometimes you are like your internet is blocking you or your isp is blocking uh some of the uh ports on the uh, game or like you can go online and check for the uh servers if they're up online and running because this this uh activation what well, i call it trash division they they use it like trash server like that's why you get lags most of the time so they don't just the uh the, you know they don't use good servers they're trying to save money and push a lot of marketing trash over here to us like yeah at least me i don't mind to pay for a, a game or buy buy uh uh operator skins like blueprint weapons and all that but if they're not i don't mind supporting them if they're not giving me a good game to play then why would i spend my money on a, on a corporation that doesn't care about me enjoying the game as a as a consumer because i'm paying for their game you know and and they're they're not fixing it. they fix one thing and then they mess up another thing so that's one of the big problems we have with this game here and it's not only me a lot of people i see on reddit complaining about it uh, about that error or they lag as a lot so in order for you to play this game you need at least 100 megabits per second download speed and uh make sure there's no one else uh in your network there's nothing else running on your network because then you will lag i do i have uh one gig down and a 40 megabits upload from spectrum so you know you can play with 100 megabits you can play as long as you don't have multiple devices uh you can play this game just easy and smooth with about five devices connected to your network you have more than five then that's a problem but like i said uh that's the uh that's uh that's what i i i find out that it worked for me 
on the it's the the error is called humane negative uh error so that's what that's what it's called see i'm gonna test my network's speed and i have multiple devices on my network i have at least uh, i would say uh about 20 to 30 devices from smart TV, Roku, Xbox, uh, Nvidia Shield, computer, uh, cell phones, a lot, a lot of stuff running on the network. So there's some uh, camera, but they're isolated from the um, from a main network. And the see that's that's the speed I get. So. That's all guys, so thank you for watching and I'll see you on the next video.